Why does Yuna have so much center time? I'm here for this. Hey guys, it's Zach back again with another video, and today Itzy has came back with Icy, and I'm excited to watch it. We know that Dalla Dalla, that is like a bop, that is a great song. And you know what, I wasn't really here for Della Della at the beginning, I'm not about to lie. I was just like, this is a little bit too different. I don't like how they're doing the mismatched concepts, the song sounds like three different songs, it's wild, but then, literally the next day, this was me. <laughs> but it's just like... I need to get used to the sound and I need to kind of know what's coming up but for Itzy like I feel like that's their style to do like a disjointed type thing almost like a red velvet but they also add the cuteness in there like twice and then they add the girl crush in there like black pink so honestly Itzy to me is kind of a mashup of all those three groups together which is super interesting so you know now I'm like here like with a more like open mind to the song and arrangements and I kind of know how Itzy gets down even with Want It like that song is wild it is a riot so I kind of know what to expect a little bit from Itzy so you know I'm excited to watch Icy all right let's get started in three two one hey hey, Ooh. hey. Oh, her hair is so pretty. I love her as well. Favorite. Okay, Yuna. Yuna Center? Huh? I see that I'm icy. Oh, where are we? We have some diversity. I like it. I wanted to hear her rap more, so I'm excited. All right. Oh, Leah. She looks so pretty. If somebody walked into a diner like this, I would be shook. I wouldn't even know what to do. Yeji. Why does Yuna have so much center time? I'm here for this. I'm actually like... I keep walking. Cherry on, so pretty. That's me in the back. Oh, I love her rap. Oh. Yuna is honestly too powerful. I love her. Well, but Yeji is my favorite though. Yeji's ponytails. Yeji's pigtails. Come on. I love her voice. I'm surprised I'm like really into this one. Like, okay. This reminds me of Cho uh, Pop's Chocolate Shop from Riverdale. <laughs> oh my god. What? Oh my god, oh my god. Yeji. They do this all the time. Yeji is unmatched. Like, Yeji is so powerful, I can't. Did you see that split thing they did? What the? The instrumental also gives me a little bit of Dalla Dalla vibes also, and I like it. I keep walking, okay. Okay, okay. I love that pun, like the play on words. I see that I'm icy, so cool. Oh. These outfits though. You guys. I actually loved Icy. Like, what the heck? I thought I was going to be like, uh, I am not feeling it right now. 
I need to listen to it again. That was how I was with Dalla Dalla. That's how I was with like Rev Rev with Zim Zala Beam. Like, Icy, like, first listen though? Like, what? I'm actually here for it. Like, it was a little bit disjointed. There was a lot going on, but I honestly really liked it. I feel like once you know like Itzy style and like you hear their songs and their music, it's to be expected. And um, for me, like why Zim Zalabim was so jarring for me for, from Red Velvet is because I'm used to knowing their upbeat and peppy red sound or their smooth R&B sexy velvet side. And when we had like Zim Zalabim, like it was just, my mind was in like shambles. Like I was just like, what the heck? But for, I ended up liking Zim Zalabim also, side note, but for Icy though, like I was expecting it to be wild. Like I was expecting it to be crazy and I was expecting to really like it. Um, and I'm happy that I did. We had some really interesting concepts for the music video. I feel like for Icy, the um, music video like production and storyboard was more concise and uh, more focused and targeted than Dalla Dalla's was. I feel like Dalla Dalla, the story you can't really um, get into that well. Uh, you do see that they have luggage, you see that they're on an elevator, you see that they're at an airport and uh, some other places are dancing on cars and they look really beautiful and aesthetic, but like there's no really story that you can connect it to. But for Icy, each girl had a role it looked like and each one was like in a different environment. So this already like projects us and we can kind of make our own connections about what is going on. Are they meeting up together? Do they know each other? What's going on in this world? Like it gives it a little bit more depth. And I do really commend uh, Joe IP for giving Icy some more like flavor with the MV. Uh, and it gives the fans something more to dive into. So I really like that. Um, also like Yeji. Come on, like Yeji's my favorite ever since I saw my life. Ever since I saw that, it was a rap. But like, Yeji really snapped in this. And for that little dance break section in the middle, like her dancing for me was unmatched. Like, I'm gonna say it, like she snapped on that. And like even when she like left the center and went to the side, my eyes were still on Yeji because she's that powerful and commanding as a dancer and her two pigtails are so iconic and i hope they never leave so <laughs> that's what i have to say about that but the other girls um were amazing but the one that really stood out to me um as well as yeji was yuna yuna had so much center time and it was like during the courses and i was just like what like Yuna is stepping out and getting all of this time, and I really like how she's able to do the little cute, like, singing voice, but she can rap. Like, this girl, like, she can actually rap really good. So, I was a big fan of that, and Yuna is somebody definitely to look out for, and I think that she is a essential and powerful part of ITZY, and I'm so happy that she is in the group. But anyways, I'm really excited to listen to the rest of the album. Um, it's not out at the moment, I guess. I think it's coming out a little bit later. But I am really like looking forward to listening to the song Cherry. I heard the little highlight um, spoiler thingy. And Cherry sounded like my type of song. And uh, they're saying like Cherry on top, blah, 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 blah. Like it was like a little bit of like rapping type thing and i don't know it sounded really good so i want to hear cherry so bad so i'm going to be definitely looking out for that but you guys look out for the rest of their album i'm sure it's going to be amazing and their new songs sound fire so overall i said it before i feel like itzy is like a mashup of red velvet twice and blackpink literally all mashed together and they are making their own style their own flavor and their own like uniqueness as a group together and they're definitely doing it right so i'm happy for them all right you guys that is all we have for today thank you again so much for watching if you enjoyed this don't forget to like and subscribe but other than that we will see you guys soon